Hello YouTube. So today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can uh, run, uh, you can make a script which will run automatically whenever the file is updated. So without wasting time, let's get started. Uh, so first of all, I have made a custom, uh, you know, my uh, virtual environment, which is this one. And uh, I have also a text file, uh, which I will edit. So let's raise this. I mean empty this one and I have empty Python file and I have index uh, sorry requirement which is watchdog so uh, for this you have a dependency uh, what you have to install is so let you firstly you have to make a virtual environment so you can make with this command so if you, uh, first of all for that for if you have to install virtual env and after that you can access to this command and this will uh, create this folder here okay so after creating this folder, you can activate this environment. So this will indicate that your environment has been activated. And uh, after that, um, so this is listed. So you can, I mean, let's say, let's delete this one. And uh, let's pip freeze environments.txt. This will make the file and list all of your requirements for this project. and. Uh, Let's go to our index.py and in index.py what you have to do is first uh, the library you install you have to import uh, some event handler and observer from that so first of all from observer you have to import the observer okay which is a class and from watchdog.events you have to import the file system event observer event handler and uh, then you can then you have to make a uh, a custom class and name it whatever you want and uh, then you have to inherit this into this class okay and then you have to make a function which is on modified which will take two arguments self and event and after that you have to check for the path okay so we are right now we are going to uh, update this file so that's why we are checking for uh, a specific file so uh, if something is uh, updated in this file or so if this file is modified then run this code okay so you can write multiple codes here so like web scrapping or whatever you want and then you have to initialize this class which will be which we can store in observer or whatever you name this and uh, then with the help of that instance you have to schedule the handler which you just made and uh, schedule it to uh, observe the Current directory okay so this period means that uh, you are watching the local directory so which is this one so all of the files on this one and you then you have to start the observer okay then we are going to do some exceptional handling and uh, uh, we will run uh, that observer continuously and uh, so that's why we have taken while true and pass so we might want to stop of that at some point and for that we can use keyboard interrupt exception and then we if uh, if we do something like uh, interrupt our running script with keyboard then it will stop the file otherwise it will keep uh, keep running okay and then you have to join the observer okay so right now we are observing this file so let's go to this file and let's give it a name my name okay so nothing right uh, so first of all we have to run our python script index.py so right now it is running and so our file it is saved and so let's uh, modify it and we need to so you can see file has been updated okay so this is how so this is the script this is how you can make a script which will automatically run some specific code on modifying this uh, text file or it can be anything i mean not just a text file so it can be a csv or pdf or some, uh, maybe something uh, python file vuejs javascript or anything like that okay uh, so this is all for this video so i'll see you in the next